Hey what's up everyone, Safety and Technology News here and today I've got a really cool tutorial for you. I'm going to be showing you how you can undo a message you've already sent in Gmail. So the first step is to click on the gear icon in the top right hand corner and then click on settings. This is actually just going to take you to the settings page where you can customize all kinds of things about your Gmail. But what you actually want to do is make sure you're on the general tab and then scroll down to the undo send option. When you're here, go ahead and click Enable Undo Send, and then you have the option to set a cancellation period between 5 and 30 seconds. Basically, this is just the amount of time after you send the email that you're still able to cancel and stop it from being sent to the recipient. So generally, I just go with 30 seconds since this is the maximum amount of time, and it gives me a little bit more warning if I do actually want to cancel the email, but you can select any of these and it'll work just fine. So now that I've done that, I'm just going to go to the bottom of the page and click Save Changes, and it's actually just going to go ahead and save that to my account. All right. So now that I've actually enabled the undo send feature, I'm going to go ahead and test this out by writing an email to a random contact. So if I just go ahead and fill in the email tab with the email I want to send this to, go ahead and set the subject to, let's just say, hello, and I'm just going to make the body of the text say, how's it going? Now if I actually go ahead and send this by clicking the send button, I have a new option that says undo at the top. So this is going to be visible for 30 seconds, which is the amount of time that I set, but if I actually click the undo option during that amount of time, it's just going to go ahead and undo the send, and I I get to edit the email a little bit more or I can just discard it altogether. But long story short, it actually stops it from going out to the contact I would have sent it to. And this again, it's a very useful feature if you do type something you don't mean to or if you just want to take one last look over an email after you've already sent it. But anyways though, give me your opinions on this feature in the comments below. Let me know if you think it's useful or if you won't be using it that much. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and you thought it was helpful and I will see you next time.